what is up guys it's time for newland back at it again with another crypto video thank you guys for tuning in i really appreciate all the support if you guys are new here make sure that you smash that subscribe button and hit the bell icon so that you can get notified when i post new videos because this is time sensitive information so you don't want to miss out anyway in today's video what i want to talk about of course is solana nfts as i'm sure you guys are aware the price of solana has been exploding over the past month it has literally gone from a five dollar project back in january to a 200 dollar project guys $200. it's absolutely crazy to think about but anyway i'm sure you guys are aware that most of that price run up is attributed to the rise of nfts especially on solana's ecosystem so what i want to do today is exactly what i did in my last video for the cardano ecosystem and that is show you guys how to set up your wallet how to find the marketplace and of course how to find brand new nfts that haven't even dropped yet so make sure that you stick around until the end of this video because that's what i'm going to show you guys that website how to find brand new upcoming nfts anyway first things first we got to do the market overview so let's jump right into coin market cap and get started with that Alrighty guys, here we are. We are at coin market cap and as you can see the crypto market cap is sitting at 2.11 trillion dollars up 1.2% today. Not too bad. Not too bad. Happy to see that it's coming up, especially since we had a huge dip in the price yesterday. Um, but what can you say? What can you say? You know, Ben from BitBoy Crypto actually said it perfectly yesterday. He said when there's huge dips in the price, what it does is it allows for huge volume to flow into the space, in or out, of course. But as you can see, the 24 hour, hour volume is sitting at $151 billion. So that's money that's flowing into the market. And basically when there's huge dips, what it does is it causes people that haven't been in the market to jump in because they think that they're gonna get it at a discount. So I think it's good. I think it's setting us up for another pump before this bull market is over that's really what i think but anyway moving on down we got to talk about bitcoin and ethereum really they haven't moved much since yesterday's dip that's okay though because we have massive gains from altcoins specifically algorand which i'm gonna actually make a video about after this uh, so stay tuned i'm gonna be posting a video about algorand soon uh, but really what i wanted to talk about today of course is solana and why do i want to talk about solana that's because NFTs on Solana are absolutely booming. And really, I think that the boom in NFTs on Solana is what is responsible for the price of Solana going up. So really, what I wanna talk about right now is what is Solana? Because I'm sure there's a lot of people out there that don't know what it is. You know, first things first, you gotta know that it is a competitor to Ethereum. And that's because it basically is Ethereum on steroids. It's able to handle far more far more transactions per second than Ethereum. It's also able to handle everything Ethereum is able to handle, except it's proof of stake instead of proof of work, which is awesome. Also, it has what's called proof of history, which is something that enables its encryption to be far more superior than your traditional crypto. So I'm super excited about Solana because I'm sure you guys are aware Ethereum gas fees are absolutely horrendous. I showed you guys in my last video, it was going to cost $300 to transact on Ethereum's network. So that's just out the window, guys. So that's why everyone is switching over to Solana and Cardano, especially for NFTs. And really, I think if Ethereum doesn't do something about its gas fees soon, it's going to be too late and the NFT space is going to be transitioning over to Solana as well as cardano so let's do this guys now that we know what solana is and how the nfts work let's actually jump into it but the first thing that we got to talk about is this it's i think it's pretty funny steve harvey is the new face of solana's nft boom do you guys agree with that if you agree with that drop a thumbs up down in the comments guys i think it's funny but it's pretty cool because Steve Harvey is not someone that I would think would get into NFTs. And as you can see, he bought an NFT and actually uses that NFT as his profile picture on Twitter. So I think that's pretty funny. Uh, but what we got to do now, guys, is actually 
set up a wallet and the wallet that i'm gonna set up is the phantom wallet now this wallet is just like metamask it's just like daedalus or euroi it is an extension on chrome that allows you to to store your crypto's private keys on the cloud and access them from your computer so it's pretty awesome it's super simple to set up so let's go through it right now and then after this we're going to go over to the marketplace and i'll show you guys how to connect it to the marketplace so that you can make purchases directly from your browser super awesome so let's do it click the add to chrome button it's going to take you to this website where you will be able to add phantom.app as an extension to your chrome browser so you know it might take a couple seconds here it's gonna you know download and then once it downloads you're gonna actually be able to access the phantom wallet from your little browser extension tab so as you can see once it's done downloading it's gonna take you to this page right here where you're gonna be given two options one to create a new wallet that's if you don't have a wallet already and then if you already have one what you can do is you can use your, your secure or sorry what you can do is you can use your secret recovery phrase to recover your wallet onto this device so what we're going to do is we're going to create a new wallet so click that and then of course it's going to give you this secret phrase so i all i actually already have a wallet so this one is just going to be a dummy account so what i would recommend for you guys is that you guys write this down on a on a, a physical piece of paper and store it somewhere safe because you don't want to take a screenshot of this or store it somewhere on your computer because if a hacker is able to get into your computer and access that account or see these words they now have access to your funds and there's absolutely nothing you can do about it so i'm going to take a picture because this isn't my real thing and then uh or actually you can actually copy it so that's pretty cool and then uh i don't know why that would enable that option for you to copy it because that just enables you to do exactly what I said not to do, which is store it on the computer. Don't do that. Store it on a physical piece of paper and store that somewhere safe. Because once you lose that, or once somebody else gets that, there's nothing you can do about it. So now what we're gonna do is create a password. Of course, agree to the terms of service that nobody reads ever. And then that's it. We are done. We are now set up officially. So we now officially, as you can see, we're gonna go up here to our extensions tab. We now have our Phantom Wallet set up. So as you can see, I don't have any Solana in here right now, but what I can do is I, I can actually receive Solana on here deposited from an exchange. So I'm sure some of you guys watching probably already have Solana. If you do, you probably have it on an exchange. In which case you'll be able to send it to this wallet just like you would ethereum to metamask or just like you would cardano to euroi super simple so you click send scan the qr code or copy the wallet address and send it on over super easy straightforward to the point so that's it guys congratulations you now have a phantom wallet so what i'm going to show you now is salon art guys salonart.io and first, really, what I want to show you is this. I made this little document. Everything you need to know for NFTs, guys, right here. Solana, right here, Marketplace, the new projects, Cardano, Marketplace, new projects, Ethereum, Marketplace, new projects. It's all here, everything you need to know. So for Solana, the Marketplace is called SolanArt.io. So now that we have our wallet set up and we are on SolanArt's website, we can actually connect our wallet to the website. And it's super easy guys it's just like metamask you just click connect wallet you click your actual wallet and click connect and then you go over here and click auto approve and connect and it is that simple as you can see we're not connected to solana and we're ready to buy some nfts of course if we had solana but we don't have any solana right now but this website is just like OpenSea, except simpler and that is because it's brand new guys this ecosystem is just starting out and because of that there is not much to see on this website there's really only 12 projects it looks like is that it 12 projects and 
that's because, like I said, NFTs on Solano's ecosystem are brand new. But really, this is what's causing so much explosion in the space. Um, you know, I clicked on Soul Punks. This is one of the most popular projects that is offered on Solana. Um, and as you can see, once it loads, give it a second. As you can see, the floor price for Soul Punks is 12.3 Solana. So it's sitting at a price of nearly $200, that would bring the floor price close to 2,400 American dollars. So it's absolutely crazy. This space is exploding and we've been seeing it explode right before our eyes for the past two and three weeks. So I'm super excited, you know, but for a lot of us, that's gonna be way too hard to attain, right? A $2,400 floor price. There's a lot of us out there that want to get into the NFT space, but don't want to spend thousands of dollars. So what I would suggest you do is check out this website right here, which is called howrare.is. If you do the forward slash drops, you'll be able to see upcoming drops on the Solana ecosystem that are going to be super cheap. Now, of course, you guys have to keep in mind, this is risky. All of this is risky. So. Of course, it's not financial advice, but I would only put in what I would be willing to lose. That's my plan, right? And I hope maybe that's your plan too. Don't put in too much money. You know, you're kind of taking a gamble when you're buying projects that are just starting out, you know, especially on a new ecosystem. But with that being said, Solana has been exploding over the past month. There's been thousands and thousands, probably millions of unique wallet addresses that have been created on the ecosystem. So because of that and the influx and drastic rise in price of current NFTs on the market, I would say that it's probably a safe bet to try and scoop some projects up, especially if they're at a cheaper price. So that's pretty much all I wanted to talk about today to give you a brief overview of the NFT market NFT space for Solana's ecosystem, show you guys how to set up the wallet, how to connect it to the actual website. And then of course, show you this, this little website right here, which is the drops. Alrighty guys, that is all I have for you guys today. I hope you guys found this video useful. If you guys did, if you made it this far, make sure you smash that like button, drop a comment down below. And of course, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Really appreciate all you guys. I hope you guys have a beautiful day, a beautiful night, wherever you guys are. Dylan is out.